Recursive definitions and algorithms are very common in computer science. The basic idea is to define a large structure or to solve a large problem through a reduction to a smaller instance of itself. Proofs by induction are closely re related to the concept of recursion. We can prove a statement P of n, where n is a natural number, by on one hand proving that P of 0 holds and on the other hand proving that if the statement holds for parameter value n, then it also holds for parameter value n plus 1. So in other words, if P of n holds, then P of n plus 1 also holds. We discuss in this chapter different forms of the induction principle and of recursive definitions. Let's start by defining the set of natural numbers. And obviously you have seen natural numbers already in high school and maybe even earlier on, um, but I want to define it in a different style, anticipating the introduction of the induction principle. So I want to define the set of natural numbers um, in the following way. I will say that the set N of such numbers it satisfies the following three properties. So on one hand we have that zero is, is a natural number. And then I say if n is a natural number, then also n plus 1 is a natural number. And moreover, I'm saying that these are all the natural numbers you have. There is no other recipe of introducing natural numbers except through rules um, 1 and 2. Um, and equivalently, I mean, about this condition 3, that these are all the natural numbers, uh, I can also rephrase this and I can say that the uh, set N of natural numbers is the smallest uh, set satisfying properties uh, 1 and 2. So that's another way of saying that you can only introduce natural numbers through these rules. You start from 0 and you declare 0 to be a natural number. And then you say, if I already have um, a natural number, then also I also have the successor, successor n plus 1. Um, and with, with this, I, I want to um, show you that this is a so-called well-ordered set. So I'm going to, to show you this in, in just a moment. Um, and that's going to be the foundation on which we are basing the uh, induction principle. So I want to define what these um, well-ordered sets uh, are. A set X is said to be well-ordered with respect to some order relation if any non-empty subset A of that set X has a least element X0 with respect to this um, uh, order relationship. So what this means is that for any non-empty subset A of X, you will have an element in that, uh, in that subset A in such a way that it's smaller than or equal to, to any other element uh, of A. So if this property holds true for any non-empty subset A of X, then we say that X is um, uh, well ordered. But I want to show you what this all means uh, in the case of uh, natural numbers. And this uh, um, holds the name of the well ordering principle. And what this says is that the set N of natural, natural numbers is in fact well ordered with respect to the usual um, less than or equal to relation that we are all used to. And, and this, in fact, is the um, very foundation of the induction principle, because it means that we can start from um, zero and then think about, uh, you know, the successor of zero and, and the successor after that. And you will see what this means uh, in terms of uh, proving properties uh, for, for natural numbers. Um, I want to prove this um, uh, lemma uh, for you, and, and the proof goes as follows. Um, let's consider a non-empty subset of uh, n. And let's prove that this has a list uh, element. So the way we are going to show that it has a list element um, is, is like this. We are going to check if 0 is in a, and I'm putting here a question mark, maybe it is, maybe it's not, then we are going to check if 1 is in A, uh, then we are going to check whether 2 is in A, um, and, and so on. So we, we do it, you know, one by one, starting from 0. And the first number that belongs to A um, is going to be the least element of, of, uh, of set uh, A. 
Um, and so that, that proves uh, really uh, with a very easy, almost trivial argument that uh, indeed any non-empty subset of uh, N has a least element.